thinking? For me, it was really hard not to complain, but boy, I found quite a lot of things that I could be thankful for. And usually when we're thankful for something, it's because we put value on it, or we think it's worth something. And usually worth is connected to money. So I brought with me some coins today, and I want to ask you, when you see something that you would rather have, then I want you to raise your hand, okay? So I brought with me a penny or a nickel. So would you rather have a penny or a nickel? To give you some help, a nickel is actually worth five pennies. So most people would probably choose the nickel. So would you rather have a nickel or a dime? Now, a dime is actually worth two nickels or 10 whole pennies. So most people would probably choose the dime. But would you rather have a dime or a quarter? And a quarter is worth two and a half dimes. So most people want the quarter, which is worth 25 whole pennies. And you know, it's easy to choose between these, right? I would much rather have a quarter than a penny because a quarter is worth more. All right, so here's the really tricky one. Are you ready? Would you rather have a quarter or a Nintendo Switch? You sure? You don't want the quarter? I'm guessing most of you said that you wanted the Nintendo Switch. And I can't blame you. Because did you know that a Nintendo Switch is worth about 1,200 quarters? Or it's worth 300,000 pennies. It's worth a lot. And that's why I decided to buy a case for it because I want to make sure that I'm able to keep it protected and so when I travel it doesn't get bumped or bruised or no harm comes to it, right? And do you know that Jesus actually looked at you and I and said, you are so priceless to me. You are worth so much to me and I want to send you some protection. So he actually sent his Holy Spirit to protect us from harm. So whenever we decide to pray, Jesus, I want you as my Lord and my Savior, then the Holy Spirit actually comes down and lives in us and forms a kind of case and protection against wrong things. Now, we can have a case and not use it. So just like the Holy Spirit, we could have it, but if we don't use it, how much good is he going to protect us? Probably not very well. So we have to remember to use that protection that Jesus has given us. And remember that you are such a treasure to God. And you know, treasure is all about what our vacation Bible school is going to be this summer. So I am so excited to invite you to join us for vacation Bible school. This is going to be treasured, finding out that we are treasure by God. So in your groups today, I want you to talk about something that you find a lot of worth in, something that you would want to protect and keep close. And until then, I'll see you guys next week. Bye!